Mike Guerin from AgForce here with Georgie Somerset and Shane McCarthy. AgForce has just spent three days in Rockhampton this year thinking about its priorities. The things that are critical for us to advocate for and on behalf of growers throughout Queensland. It's a critical conversation. We have it once a year, make sure it's absolutely aligned with member need and have those broad conversations of bringing the priorities together for our work plan, for you, for the next couple of years. Georgie, some critical conversations and some changes given what's in front of us. Yeah, look, I think there'll, there'll be no surprises in this list and, and I've got the list in front of me because I don't want to forget anyone's favourite. Um, I don't think any, any members will be surprised that biosecurity came through as a really strong uh, topic that people want us to work on and workforce. You know, the, the two really clear messages I hear a lot from people, we need to keep us, our, our property safe, we need to keep our borders safe, but we need people to work in there. Um, and I think you know, inter really interesting one is around the, the market access and our social licence. So we're in the middle of EU free trade negotiations. We are talking a lot about social licence, but we need to work uh, collaboratively at a national level around market access. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Georgie. And Shane, some of the other big ones, your first year as a Deputy President through this conversation. Yeah. Three tough days, as you described it. What's yes. come out of it? A uh, lot. Uh, like it's been robust, the, the debate, and uh, we've been through an extensive process of uh, yeah, uh, going through the priorities and you know there seems to be the same recurring ones that, that are coming through all the five here. Biosecurity, uh, land use talks, uh, veg management, so they're, they're big ones that we need to do and we need to process over the next couple of, couple of years as well. Uh, workforce, the availability for workforce as well, so yeah, and there's been some really good ones. Yeah and I think the, 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 uh, the last couple, telecommunications which won't surprise a lot of our our members because uh, that's something that they're wanting to see us increase that footprint but it was also about how do we make sure our data is safe when we're handing it on to other people as we use more of the internet of things and how do we increase that coverage on our properties and the other big one is sustainability and it's not just about the environmental sustainability but actually about our businesses and our workforces and, and our communities and how do we have a truly sustainable environment where we're rewarded for landscape management and we have really uh, content families and, and employees and a great community community. So many of your electeds travelled many miles to be here for three days, 10, 11, 12 hours drives to spend time and be clear about our priorities. You can see them here in short form, more detail from us soon. If you want to get involved in some of the committees as Ag Force members, plenty of slots to take up, welcome that. Thank you.